again. And um, let's see. You want a real quick synopsis of what happened that night? Or uh, tell me what you'd like me to talk about, other than we have them. And we're excited about that part. Uh, yeah, maybe you could do just a, a brief recap. All right. right. So about 12, uh, a little bit before 12.42, because that's when the first call came in. The, uh, there was an altercation between three men and our suspect. And don't ask me to say their names, because I can't. And uh, they, the management, during the altercation, separated them, took the one person, actually got him cleaned up, took him to the bathroom, got him cleaned up, and sent him out, out the building right away. The, uh, the suspect uh, walked from, I guess, the, one of the doors, circled around to the other part of the building, came back in, and went to uh, two, of the sus two of the people that had passed away and shot uh, two of them. They both died inside. And then uh, he jumped the fence, crossed over the 15th Street, right across the street right there, went across the street, got in a, a gunfight with the third person that passed away. And uh, then he took off. I still don't know. We, we as a department may know this, but I don't know how he got from there to the place that he stole uh, the car. He went to a house that he knew in Mount Pleasant, took, took a car from them, knocked on the door, they weren't gonna give it to him, took a car, they reported it stolen, and then a, a period of time later, he brought the car back in Mount Pleasant, uh, came and, and they, they had a phone call that says he's at our door, he's bringing the car back, come and arrest him. So they picked him up, Mount Pleasant called us, said, would you happen to be looking for this guy? And we said yes. So he's in our 